acting. A game of chance, luck, and of being in the right place at the right time. For a small minority, it is a path that can lead to fame, fortune, and seemingly endless opportunity. For most working actors, however, they can spend decades plying their craft in the theatre, on film, or on television, without ever becoming well known. So what of these unsung heroes? This series draws attention to these jobbing, working actors who, by whatever circumstance, have remained relatively faceless behind their more famous counterparts, yet whose work is by no means any less important. Welcome to Unsung Heroes of Acting. I know, I don't, I don't, I don't know anything about money, the what? extra. I don't care, yeah? They don't know us. They don't know us, we're family. They don't understand. You have to do what you have to do for your family. In a career currently spanning just 20 years, British actor Sinead Matthews has over the years built an impressive body of work, encompassing a vast array of different roles in theatre, film and television. Since graduating from RADA in 2003, she has been in consistent demand, equally adept at playing both comedic and dramatic roles. When performing comedy, she can play different types of the genre with ease. For example, in the show Ideal, she expertly underplays and is admirably deadpan. Oh, Felix. I should go. Baby Jenny needs changing. Do you think Felix suspects? Suspects what? All this. Me and you. Oh, no. He doesn't suspect. He knows. He knows? I told him. Just like that? We're going to mention it to me first. <laughs> you already know. With the character of Jenny, Matthews taps into an inner child, blissfully oblivious to the chaos surrounding her. Bitch. Piss up. What was that? Pop it. Oh, it's you doing it. I thought there were a Dalek in here for a minute. Come on, then. Things to do. Before I go, can I ever go on your talker? That is so funny. Jen! What? She never asks for or demands the laugh. Instead, the laughs arrive from the very truthful and human way that she allows Jenny to behave. It's believable, vulnerable, and highly amusing. As to her doing a special deal on them baby grows that she were talking about, but tell her if she wants the plain white ones, they're one pack of four for four. Nikki doesn't live here. Right. See ya. A further example of this style of comedy playing can be seen in Hole Raisers. You've got to reinvent yourself when you've had a kid. Me and Dane didn't have any for 15 and a half days when Jake was born. Wait, sorry, you had sex 15 days after you gave birth? Yeah. Christ alive, I'd be humping furniture after two weeks without... Yeah. i tell you what your brother likes. Don't tell us what Dane likes, Paula. I bought a pink wig from the Esso Road. I make her, I'm a stripper from Purple Door. She's called Marcella. Just getting that wig out of the bin bag, it drives him wild. Oh, oh. Actually, no. Rustling any bin bag does it to him now. He's that one of those dogs with a bell. Raw play turn, you gotta keep things spicy. <laughs> this gift that Matthews has for playing a scene straight is also apparent in the short film Bed Tricks. I've brought some with me, oh. if that's okay. To be honest, I like messing around. <laughs> and it usually tires them out. Huh? You're under arrest! <laughs> oh, Matthews is also capable of a broader style of character comedy, as seen in films such as Nanny McPhee Returns. But I am Miss Topsy and this is my colleague Miss Turvey. Charmed. Can you guess who sent us? Father Christmas. <laughs> You're flirting with us, Phil. <laughs> In Miss Topsy, we are given a glorious character who manages to be cute and threatening all at once. <laughs> <laughs> Mrs. Biggles won't like it. 
Mrs. Big says you owe her. You ran up a big fat debt in one of her Riverside casinos. See what you've gambled away, Phil. I owe one farm. Where is your farm, Phil? This fun with the largeness and size of character is also seen in the Hogfather. This in pillow money owing, I admit, but I signed the form GB90 about collection and answer the question? I don't know. I've never been here before. <laughs> It's worth mentioning too that Matthews has a great flair for dialects and accents. She even ventures into playing a European pseudo-French character in The Roof. Uh, Peter is in theatre. Here, there is ladder. He on ladder, uh, then he off ladder. So he falls. <laughs> I see, yes, yes, it's, uh, there is also fire. Matthews is just as convincing in dramatic roles, possessing a great ability to access the dark places and to make bold choices. Who want us out? I don't know. I don't know. You've been signing on, haven't you? Yeah, I think so, yeah. You've been signing on, haven't you? That's all you have to do, right? I said I'm sorry. In Jellyfish, her performance as a mother suffering from bipolar disorder is beautifully detailed and observed. We're going to be all right, aren't we? We're always all right, as long as we stick together, yeah? As long as we stay together. You know what we should do? We should celebrate. We need to have a party. Well, we need to get to school. <gasps> Shall we go to Dreamland? <gasps> Shall we go to Dreamland? Mum. Dreamland! 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 She never plays for sentiment or sympathy. What you see is uncompromising and raw. I'm sorry, all right. I'm, I'm sorry that I'm sick. She disappears seamlessly under the skin of who she is playing, whether they are attractive souls or complicated and unlovable. The result is captivating and ultimately heartbreaking. Stand up. What, like... Like comedy. <laughs> comedy, you. What have you got to tell jokes about? <laughs> uh, no, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm not laughing at you. Well, actually, I suppose that would be quite a good thing, wouldn't it? Me laughing at you. <laughs> Why are you like this? Sarah, come on, lighten up. What are you meant to be a comedian? Sinead Matthews is definitely a performer on the rise, who constantly amazes with a vast range. She continues to challenge and stretch herself with hard-hitting roles, but then can completely surprise us by giving a virtuistic comedic performance. A supremely gifted actor, it can be said with confidence that Sinead Matthews will remain unsung and unknown for only a little while longer.